welcome everybody to the collecting brothers we are doing a action figure review here of the marvel legends daredevil the man without fear three pack we're getting bullseye you're getting daredevil in his classic red suit and you're getting electra here's a back shot of the packaging so yeah you're getting bullseye with his throwing daggers um, you're getting daredevil you're getting an Electra. And man, look at that big old hair from Electra. It just looks real good. <laughs> but yeah, let's go ahead and crack it over. We're just going to take this. Just cut it along the seam here. Now, this was a Hasbro exclusive. Or Hasbro Pul Pulse exclusive. So, and I believe they're still in stock if you... As of this recording, at least. Um, let's go ahead and take a look at the box art. We're getting... Get bullseye electro on this side and over here the man without fear maddie himself get this beautiful daredevil shot here daredevil the man without fear i like the exclamation point very reminiscent and of course all the legalese barcode in the plastic free packaging that's for everybody there all right let's go ahead and open her up Okay, we're also getting this beautiful Electra head. I love how crazy this is. Um, of course, not going to get a lot of articulation out of this. But man, that is not the point of this head. Gorgeous. Along with that, we're also getting two kunais. What did he say? Ooh, looks like mine's super bent. This one. Let's check it out. Mm, just a little bit. Not too bad. Nothing a little heat gun can't work, fix up. It is kind of... It sucks when uh, it is like that, though. So, it's just a little extra work that we got to do. And, of course, she also comes with these two fisted hands. Oh. Man, I can't go over this head, though. This is amazing. Just looks great. Okay, there's Electra's accessories. We'll get ahead and set those aside. Let's get Electra out. We're getting that pinless on the uppers and lowers. Man, really love to see that. A little skirt overlay. And the uh, full cap, do rag style bandana. Comes with a peg hole in the back, that's interesting. Not sure what that's for. But again, with Electra's hair, just where it's so big, we're not going to get a lot of articulation. But just a little bit, just to make her give her some attitude, you know. And some open fisted hands with the swivel there, and holding hands. Again, I really do like the paint on this. They're doing a really good job on these new figures. I'm going to pop this head off. I, it's cool, but <laughs> I'm here for this big old, big old hairdo. Let's see. There we go. All right. Got a little bit of that off-camera strength. <laughs> but yeah, so here we have Electra, Looking really, really good. Yeah, first impressions, really, really dig this figure. Super clean. I like the way she kind of just kind of lay, kind of sits here. Let's see if we can focus. There we go. Yeah, digging it. She's just like the devil. Maddie, is it me, Electra? I forgot my memory. 
Can you help me out a little bit? Before I kill you. Ooh, yeah. This is cool. This hand is actually a kunai specific holding hand. Or the, sorry, not kunai, a sai holding hand. You did it! Congratulations! So you throw that sai in the middle. That's nice. Cool. Appreciate that detail. All right, so there we go. There's Electra. Let's go ahead and move on to Bullseye. Probably Daredevil's most iconic um, villain. So here we have Bullseye. I do like that facial expression. Look at him, man. Missing teeth. <laughs> Almost looks like he's got a dent in his head. This crazy freaking guy. Ooh, uh, look at that sheath there. That's going to be nice. Let's get his accessories out here. Feels good. I love the paint. Uh, I am seeing a little bit of spots here and there. But mm, nothing that's going to happen once I'm playing with him, right? So, I think we're okay. Okay, let's get these accessories on. Okay, make sure everything comes out. Again, with this pl plastic-free packaging, don't want to throw any away any of your goodies that you're getting. Ooh, okay, let's, first let's take a look at this one right here. This is the kunai throwing hand, and oof, a little bit bent. A little bit bent. But, I mean, just how thin that is. Can't really expect it not to. But, with how thin it is, too, you can heat that up. It'll be just fine. It looks good. I like the translucent on the... Whew, of them. Yeah, it looks clean. Outside of the bending issues... This is a really cool accessory. Okay, let's get to the next thing. We got the crazy laughing head bullseye. <laughs> He's got this scar all the way in his head. I think it looks really good. Yeah, just look at those expressions on him, man. Just looking good. Wow, that's a cool, that's a cool one. <laughs> Alright, along with that, we are also getting his, looks like a K-Bar blade. And I love that, so we can put, let's go ahead and put that in. We're going to sheath that right in here. Oh yeah. oh yeah. There it is. Ooh, you probably get some sick pose with him, like just like reaching back there for it. You know? Let's try and do that. After he's like, ah, oh, throwing his kunai's out. You can't stop me, Daredevil. And he's like, Whoosh. Zing. This is it, isn't it? Be cool. Okay, uh, so with uh, him, we're also getting that K bar, um, but then we're also getting a couple good accessory, good uh, extra hands here. We're getting that right fisted hand, we're getting that open hand, that grip hand. This is the one he'll use to hold on to the K bar on the back. And we're also getting <laughs> the finger pointed gun, the DC approved. Uh, weapon for McFarlane. It's the only thing you get. Only kind of weapon they allow out there. Uh, any other ideas? Stinky! In the DC multiverse. Let's go ahead and set this guy up. I'm really going to put him with that K-Bar holding arm. All 
All right, so he's got his K-bar. Now, what goes in here? Did I forget an accessory? Did I drop one? Oh, boy. Oh, I guess his kunai's probably going there. Yeah, he doesn't come with anything that goes in there. How interesting. A holsterless holster. A gun. A holster without a gun. Poor holster. Alright. It does look good. You even get a little bit of that silver paint there. Dang. That's nice. I thought it was just going to be all white. Cool. Yeah, we'll give him an extra gun that we got laying around. This is Bullseye. And should we do kunais? Let's do kunais. Kunai throwing hand. I think that's the look. If not, then we do... <laughs> um, man, I don't know. I think maybe it's like he's already thrown the kunais. You know what I'm saying? He like already threw them. It's on his last resort now. He's going for the K-bar. And you know what he's doing? You know what he's giving to Daredevil? He's giving Daredevil to the old finger gun. Got you, bud. Man, look at that. <laughs> now that looks nice. I dig that. I dig that a lot. You know, let's get him down. He's just got beat up. You know? He's like, this is it. This is my last resort. This is my last resort. Suffocation, no breathing. You know what I'm saying? Sheesh. Alright, we gotta clean this up a little bit here. You know what dead no bullseye needs? He's a daredevil. Let's get bullseye back there. Let's crack open Daredevil. He's already look look at him. He's already trying to get out. Come on, D. What you doing, man? What are you thinking? Oof, man. Look at this Daredevil. This thing is clean. Dang. Ooh. Toe articulation. Ain't that something? Man, that's gonna look good. Alright, so he is on that updated uh, Renew Your Vows Spider Man, I believe. You know, the toes are definitely from that. Um, but, I mean, you're getting that ball at the abdomen with the ab crunch. That's just so nice. So nice. Butterflies. A little stuck, but that's all right. And I also do, oh man, look at that! those eyes. The little shine in them. Shing! Makes them look like a real devil. And I do love that the head is a little matter. It's matty, I like it's a matte. Um, the torso is a little shiny. But that's okay. All right, man, I do love how matte everything is. A little shiny here, right here. But I think that's okay. He looks great. Look at that detailing on this cabling, I would say. Man, that looks good. All right. And then you can have two different options. Both of them will, you know, of course, have the Billy Club inserts. And you get to choose how you display those. Um, I kind of dig in the short one here a little more. I'm not having him run around like Spider Man. So we're going to put both of his clubs here. Like he just threw one out, you know. Oh my goodness, look at that. Shing! Ding, 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 ding. Okay, 
How should we have Daredevil set up? He's just about to fight. Well, he's already he's already beaten up him, right? So he's like he's gonna just have his billy clubs in his hands. He ain't gonna be zipping around yet. He's got these billies in his club in his hands. One billy club, two billy club, three billy club, four. And he's a little tired, you know. He's oh, one of my favorite poses. Is, Daredevil's just so introspective, you know. He's always just thinking about oh, how could I have done this better. Oh, Matt, you got to do it for your day yet. Oh, but oh, yeah, let's go ahead and go over some of the articulation that I'm digging. Pinless. Pinless. Toe articulation. Gotta love it, man. And these, they're really stepping up with these new figures. Um, and they're also stepping up those prices. Oof. What are you going to do? All right. He's tired. He's tired. He's on the defense, right? He's looking at him. He's like, no. No, 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 no. You're going down, boy. Boy. I said, boy, you're going down. You don't mess with your elders, boy. <laughs> Bullseye's gonna get that K bar out. Cheesh! There it is, ladies and germs. Daredevil. Fighting Bullseye. Let's go ahead and get this in here. It's a little tricky because you got to get it in and out over. I guess you could just push it in like that. Oh, that looks so good though. Or should she hold it backwards? Oh my goodness. That'd be cool. That would be cool. There we go. No real place to holster or blades but we can put it right here or we can get real weird with it i don't know how many years on this earth i got left i'm gonna get real weird with it put it back here that actually fits a little bit better Shing. all right let's get a bent sigh uh-oh and let's actually have her bolt one going forward i think that's a better pose there we go. Man, the thing is bent. That's alright. Alright, but yeah, she's over here contemplating. Daredevil, don't die! Nah, she wouldn't care. She knows Manny can handle himself. Alright. Let's go ahead and get her set up back here. Bend that foot. And there we go, friends. This is the Hasbro Pulse exclusive Daredevil Man Without Fear 3-pack with Bullseye, Electra, and Daredevil. Alright. Let's go ahead and jump into some comparisons here. Let's say goodbye, Bullseye. Goodbye, Electra. Goodbye, Alyssa. <laughs> Alright, first up For comparisons, we're going to leave Daredevil here um, We have Black Suit Spider-Man I don't have To renew your vows But that's okay Let's go ahead and get him all straightened up Nice and tall This is the high school What is that called? Uh, class photo Class photo up Let's get everyone out on the yard. No, make sure you're with your class. Come on now, don't be shy. We're just going to take a picture. Okay, got them all straight. Come on, Daredevil. All right, not too bad. A difference here. 
These boys run around you, New York, protecting everybody. Back to back. Spider-Man is does look a little taller. It does look a little taller there. Interesting. All right, so there's Black Suit Spider-Man with Daredevil. All right, let's switch out Black Suit Spider-Man for another main villain of Daredevil, Frankie. We have the Punisher. And this is an old, old school Punisher here. This is on the retro cards. Um, and I added, a, I can't remember, it's that wrestler guy, the Lucha Libre guy. I added his vest onto um, Frankie here. So, kind of cool. Kind of cool look. Wish it was the duster, you know, but that's all right. Maybe we'll get the animated version here from Hasbro soon. But here we go. Here we have Daredevil stacked up with Frank. Let's go back to back. Decent. Yeah, Frankie's a little taller. That's okay. All right. Thanks, Frank. Go clean up your streets. Next, we have. Let's go ahead and do some other villains. Um, I don't. You know, Punisher's kind of a anti-hero, so he's not really a villain. But we got Bulls. Another great villain um, is Kingpin. <laughs> Willy Fisk out here. Mm. Evening, Daredevil. How can I help you? I don't believe you've met my ring this afternoon. Or care me. I'll care to, I'll care to introduce you. And he just gives a big ol' whop. Oh. Alright, but here is Daredevil. Willy, of course, is just nice and tall compared to Daredevil. I, th I really do like this comparison here. Really, really digging this uh, matchup. Yeesh. That's going to look good on the shelf once we get them all actioned out. But there's Willie introducing Daredevil to his new ring. The mayor gave me the, the mayor gave me this ring here. All right. Thanks, Willie. Next, uh, a little less familiar <laughs> villain of Daredevil. Probably Daredevil's lamest villain that he's ever fought and we actually have him at his smallest form here we have stilt man he has the power of a ladder <laughs> the ladder man himself stilt man here's daredevil what are you even doing here give me the money come on now Ugh, i need the money to buy more stilts i need to go taller He's out here just building ladders everywhere. But yeah, still man. Daredevil to fight him once, so um, there's still man for you. <laughs> that is that is uh de -ladderiest. Smallest form, smallest form still man that you've ever seen. Alright, and then next up, kind of an odd I'm gonna do an odd comparison here. Uh, unless you've read some of the Daredevil comics here. Kind of messed up story, actually. I'm bringing in Mysterio. I'm bringing in Mysterio. There's a storyline where Mysterio, uh, playing, you know, doing his Mysterio thing, pretending to be someone else, uh, gets a baby to get dropped off in front of Maddie's church, and then they start believing that it's the Antichrist. Maddie being super religious, of course, um, has to take care of it. <laughs> And that's that dilemma, right? And it turns out, you know, it just destroys Daredevil's life, just you know, like uh, like born again. And all along, even as the reader was reading, there was never any clues for it. But Mysterio was at the center of all of that, just being a real, you know, just being real mean. <laughs> but here he is stacked up with Mysterio. Let's do a back to back here. Big old dome on Mysterio. He's got his fishbowl, so a little taller. But cool matchup there. And finally, for our last and final comparison today, we are going to compare um, my previously, my favorite Daredevil figure that I ever had. Um, I picked up the Walgreens one, the yellow and red, but it just wasn't my vibe. Um, I repainted it red. Um, 
I don't have it out right now, but I'll throw up a picture of the deconstructed uh, yellow and red Daredevil just to kind of show you guys. Maybe I'll post a video about uh, finishing that custom. Let me know. There's just a couple more parts that need to be painted. Um, yeah, it, so far it looks good. And then we could do a really good comparison on this one. Of course, it's on the old body. Uh, doesn't have nearly the level of articulation as this, as this does. But just kind of get a cool comparison. But let's go ahead and jump to our final comparison here. We have the Diamond Select Netflix Maddie Charlie Cox Daredevil. And of course, it's Diamond Select, so it's going to be taller, of course. But one thing I really dig about the Diamond Select figure here is the slenderness of, of Maddie. I think they really, really captured that really well. And I don't know, I just, I really, really dig just how slender Maddie looks here. It's nothing too big, and nothing, he's not, he's not yoked, you know. He's just being Maddie. And so. See if we can take a closer look there. Yeah, man, it looks really, really good. I also like the scruff on him, but it being six, uh, seven inch, you know, it's gonna be taller. That's not what we're comparing them. Just really, really like the slenderness, the booty, the bootness of him. Um, I think that Diamond Select really, really knocked it out of the park with that figure. But this isn't about that. This is about Maddie over here. So Matt Murdock, Murdock, the man without fear. In the Man Without Fear 3-pack. Looks great. Looks really, really great. Alright, let me know what you guys think about these figures down below. Um, if you picked it up or if you didn't. If you're going to, I'm pretty sure it's still in stock. So go check it out. I'm really, really digging this one. Man, she is top-heavy with that hair, so watch out. Just watch out, man. We gotta get her all set up again. She's got a lot of hair. It's wanting to pull her back. <laughs> Let's just get a deeper. There we go. Deeper cut there. Let's see what we can do with D. These I always see Maddie's just oh, he's just so sad. He's just a sad boy. That's why I like him so much. He's our sad boy. All right, so there is our three pack. Go ahead and leave a like, comment, subscribe to our channel here. This has been the Collecting Brothers. I'm John, and we'll catch you guys later. Peace.